Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another exciting match from Without a Cause. Whack Volume 4, with love, Whack XOXO. I am Skip Sampson, sitting here with Double J Jack Jackson. Hammerstone looking chiseled per usual. Also very concerned about his faux leather jacket. It's faux leather, of course it is. Can't claim him, but if it were real leather, that's the real concern. Daniel McCabe and Alexander Hammerstone squaring off in this matchup. Hammerstone strength right off the bat. Daniel McCabe is no slouch. She's from Vancouver, BC, Queens Park, to be exact. Big shot. Hammerstone just trying to lace him with one. And Daniel McCabe with the go behind. Just firing off punches to Hammerstone's midsection. There's that strength again. Catching a boot. Firing off a big punch to Hammerstone's Where's Kel face. Where is Kelsey Marie with that? That was a close fist. I believe, Jack, her name is Kendall Marie. Kendall Marie. Kendall Marie. Young referee out of Seattle, Washington. Clearly new on the job. Suicide dive across the floor from Danny McCabe on the outfit. Hammerstone just has not been able to get on his feet this whole match. Well, Daniel McCabe is quite the athlete. Wrestling all over Vancouver, Washington, and the United States. Yeah, I've seen his name pop up in uh, Chicago, in the Northeast. He's really starting to expand his horizons. Oh! That was a massive kick from Hammerstone. Dan Maccabe clearly on Green Street. Tell him, Maccabe, what he thinks of him. Oh, man. How is Hammerstone in deep? Hammerstone work out? No, why would I do that? Well, I have. Sight Look at the, the strength! Hole. This man's a freak of nature! That's a human! Carrying around Daniel McCabe like he's a small I haven't seen strength like that since uh, Dave Turner. Cover only gets two for Alexander Hammerstone. It's still early on. It is. It's going to take a lot more to put Daniel McCabe away than just that. Hammerstone keeps this up though, so this will be a quick match. Just unleashing him. The fact that Kabe is even still making it to his feet after those punches is something to behold. Testing it to a little to survive. Look at those boots. Hammerstone is a man. With no fear. Hammerstone's making a name for himself these days. Wrestling for Major League Wrestling. I think he's trying to end it right now. Here's to be. Makabe won't have any. Oh. Leaping on the back of Alexander Hammerstone. Got sinking, him inspired. Like a spider monkey, sinking in what appears to be a chin lock. Hoping to get a submission. Oh! Evidently, Hammerstone had a different idea. Wow. That's a, you know, Hammerstone, for being as physically statuesque as he is, I mean, he weighs 270 at least. Look at him. He's not a small man. That's He's a lot of weight coming down on another guy. A massive, massive human being. Putting in... But one can only assume is a chin lock of his own, hoping to submit Daniel Macabre. Okay. I, I've seen Macabre in action with the likes of Timothy Thatcher and other world-class athletes. Daniel does not give up. Look at him go. Just quick strikes. Hitting the ropes and eating a drop kick from Alexander Hamilton. How, how are you that large if you leave your feet? Only getting a two. Hammerstone is a tremendous athlete by his own right. People shocked out of that kick out. I would not be. That was a drop kick. And the last time somebody's won with a drop kick, as I said, was 1971. Again, you talked about this match. I'm not sure that it is. 
Alexander Hammerstone not happy with Pacific Northwest anymore. Vegan soy boys, he says. I uh, don't know if that's exactly what he meant, but I think we can all infer what he's really talking about. Hammerstone needing a big boot from Daniel Makabe in, in the corner. Makabe up and over. Oh! And a big drop kick on Alexander Hammerstone. Hammerstone's heading him back to the third row. But he follows that up by giving Makabe a clothesline of his own. Took his head square off his body. Holy boy, Hammerstone just not caring at all. Asking Kendall Marie to check his arm because he may have broke it on that dude's face. That's a direct quote from Alexander Hammerstone. Just laying, lacing him with strikes in the face of the head. Makabe is going to need to get his hands up. Looks like he has. Classic mistake, not hooking the leg. Not hooking the leg and taking a little bit too much time there. There it is. It's over now. Still only two. You know, this this young referee probably should have counted a three right there. You Ooh. seem to have quite the issue with all of our referees, and I'm not sure if you are the best judge of character. I just want you to know it's one team. I'm pretty certain that all of the battle five referees can count the three. And they all keep quite the steady pace. Now the Hammerstone, see what happens to him. Back elbow by Daniel McCabe and Hammerstone. Hammerstone catching, boxing his ears. McCabe boxing the ears and hitting with the European uppercut. Oh, that's a giant German suplex. Wow, the fact he got him off his feet like that is surprising. Oh, he's going for the octopus hold right here. See this working several times. Made famous by Tony Uno. Currently employed by the Vites of Jonathan Gresham, another technically proficient athlete. I believe Chris Brooks even used it. It's actually just been announced that in Cafe, Big kick out there by Hammerson. He's looking done. Look at him. Wow, I don't even know how I got rolled out of that, honestly. Daniel looks a little, a little confused. What is he going to do to put away Alexander Hammerstone for Jack? Probably by his ear. That's what happened with Holyfield and Tyson. Still hard hitting men in there. Woo! Toss him over heck, dog. Hammerstone is a freak of nature. That's a power bomb. That's a power That power bomb only gets Hammerstone too, though, Jack. I don't believe it. Did you? My mommy's on in the Makabe here tonight, I think. He showed an incredible amount of intestinal fortitude. I'm telling you, I think there's something wrong with these whack referees. I'm telling you, that should have been a three. Did you see that? I think Alexander Hammerstone would have to agree with you. And Kendall Murray's face right there. Here we go. Makabe I think it's over right here. I think he's going for it. Big finish. Mm. Makabe. Escapes. Yeah. Is that No. Sinks in it. Hang on. Arm. I don't know if Hammerstone was right about breaking his arm earlier. This must be terribly painful. Emerson muscles out of that. The modified Northern Light Suplex. This man has a freaking <laughs> Daniel McCabe just a little heavy. Emerson hooks him again. Oh! That's got that it. Nightmare Pendulum. Hooks him for three. Emerson just... Wow. You know, he... The damage to his arm he clearly was affecting him there, trying to lift him up for his big finish there. Thinking that if he picked everything Hammerstone had to offer, and he picked that about it. Tonight, Alexander Hammerstone proved why he is the future of professional wrestling. Hammerstone is just looking beat right now. Look at him. He's can't. Uh oh. Hammerstone. Having some trouble here leaving the, the arena. Asking for some help. Grabbing at his knee. 
without a cause photographer over to help him. What happened? Those are now in attendance. Laying on his leg. Many throws. But telling the audience what he thinks of it.